Whitaker on a Monday checking out snow equipment. Must be something good in the forecast. Let's talk about it. Good morning, Raiders. Most of you are seeing this on Monday morning, and it will be a much different weather picture outside than what we're seeing here on this beautiful, sunny Sunday morning. But I wanted to get the forecast to you because there is quite the storm moving in. As I said earlier in the year, you can't count out March. Some of our biggest snowstorms happen in March, and I think for this season, this may be the big one. All right, now this is all part of a low pressure system, actually two of them that are coming in from the west. Then it will shift energy offshore. That creates what's known as a nor'easter. With a nor'easter, you have the low pressure Winds are spinning counterclockwise around that low. That creates a northeasterly wind, which brings with it heavy precipitation because it's getting so much moisture from the ocean that it can bring heavy rain or in this case, heavy snowfall. So for your Monday, I think we'll see rain mixing with snow at times. Temperatures will be in the mid to upper 30s, maybe flirting with 40. Even though it's warm, above freezing, you can get snow sticking still if the snow's heavy enough. So can't rule out some slushy accumulations today. I don't think we'll see more than a half an inch or so. Now that rain will transition to completely snow, I think by midnight, Monday into Tuesday. We'll see some snowfall overnight into Tuesday morning. The bands could be heavy at times, potentially maybe seeing some thunder snow in some areas if we get enough convection and enough heavy snowfall. It's a potential, uh, it's a possibility. So we'll have to keep an ear open for that. And then we'll see it maybe mixing with a little bit of rain as it tapers off Tuesday. Now with this system, with temperatures in the mid thirties, the snow will be wet and heavy. And so it can become a weight issue for things like trees and power lines. And I also expect that our winds will be picking up Monday night going into Tuesday and even Wednesday. So we could have some issues with down power lines and down trees. So please be mindful of that. You may wanna charge up devices as soon as possible just to make sure they're fully charged in case we do lose power. All right, well, let's take a look at your forecast. So you'll see on this graphic that there is a winter storm watch in effect and that goes from uh, today into Wednesday actually. And so I wouldn't be all that surprised that by the time this is on, that there may be a winter storm warning. The difference between a watch and a warning is a watch means the conditions are favorable and a warning means that it's imminent or in progress. So for your Monday, look for some light snow mixing with rain. Again, temperatures flirting with 40, but we could pick up a slushy light accumulation. Overnight Monday night, we'll see lows in the low to mid 30s with snow continuing. It looks like heavy snow setting up for a Tuesday, highs in the mid 30s. You'll see the winds picking up there on Tuesday, north winds at 12 to 22 miles per hour. That's not taking into account the gusts. So it could be a bit windy for Tuesday night. Rain and snow showers will begin to taper off. Could see a lingering snow shower too into your Wednesday. Wind will continue for Wednesday, high around 40. Wednesday night, winds continue, lows in the mid 20s. And for Thursday, mostly sunny, highs in the mid 40s. And looking ahead to Friday, much different weather picture. It looks at this point to be partly cloudy with highs being in the low 50s. So March is one of those crazy months where we're a little bit of winter, a little bit of spring. It's a battle between the two. In the end, spring will win out. Thank you so much for tuning in. And uh, hopefully, no offense, I won't see any of you tomorrow. Enjoy your day.